Are you all hyped up and ready to work in your sketchbook but not sure how to best start filling those intimidatingly blank pages? Here's seven ideas that will help you overcome your creative rut. You can use your sketchbook as an art journal. Journaling not only creates memories that you can flip through again and again in the future, it's also a wonderful way to remind yourself of your priorities, work through stressful times and unhelpful thoughts, or remind yourself of the things you're grateful for. Try art journaling in your sketchbook and do it as often as you can. That way you will improve your drawing skills and create wonderful memories. Use your sketchbook as an idea book. Had an idea for your next painting, a card you want to make for your best friend, or a DIY project? Use your sketchbook to jot down your creative ideas. So next time you're in a creative rut, you can just flip through your idea book for inspiration. I especially like to draw quick thumbnails for art I want to create. This helps me work out proportions, composition, and lighting of the image. You can also use your sketchbook as a travel journal. When you're traveling, you experience so many new things, see beautiful places, and try yummy new food. You can use your sketchbook to record all your experiences in a unique way. I love sitting down in a restaurant and sketching while I enjoy foreign food, rest my tired legs, and get to know new people. You will be amazed how many interesting conversations can be prompted when people see you sketching. You can add some memorabilia and photos or some writing to complete the record of your trip. This way, you not only practice drawing with limited supplies under non-ideal conditions, but you also create a journal that you can come back to if you want to relive your travel experience. If you're in a creative rut and really don't know what to draw at all, try creating some fan art. Sometimes studying art that you love and trying to recreate it can really spark your own creativity. Getting excited about things and creating fan art for it is so much fun and has gotten me out of a creative rut many times. So if you don't know how to start your sketchbook, try creating fan art of something you really love and that makes you really happy. You can also use your sketchbook as a practice book. Have you seen an amazing art style that you want to try to master? Want to learn how to use your new and awesome art supplies? Try them out in your sketchbook to really get a feel for them. This way your sketchbook will reflect your progress as an artist and will become a place where everything is allowed and you're free to play and try new things. I especially love to study the anatomy of any subject I might want to create art of. My tip is to have your sketchbook with you wherever you go. Sitting in your doctor's waiting room, whip out your sketchbook and a pencil and practice. You can use your sketchbook for urban sketching. Urban sketching means sketching on location in an urban setting. There are many urban sketching meetups all around the world. Who knows, maybe you'll find one close by? That way you can fill your sketchbook and meet people who love art just as much as you do. Last but not least, you could also follow an art challenge. There are many art challenges online. Try Instagram for a great source of drawing prompts. This way you'll always know what to draw next. The more you sketch, the more practice you get. So if it's possible, you could even try a daily art challenge. Inktober is one such challenge that happens every October. Or check out our Hobonichi challenge on Instagram. This will give you a prompt per day all year round. I'll leave all the details in the info box below. And there you have it. Those are my seven tips on how to fill your sketchbook. These are just suggestions, of course. You do you. There is no right or wrong way to use a sketchbook. I'd love to hear how you use your sketchbooks. Leave a comment below and share. Thank you so very much for watching this video. Check out my Etsy shop for art prints and cute stamps and subscribe to my channel for weekly videos on living the creative life. Have fun filling up your sketchbooks.